mile, a mile, but a good half a point. Bouncer in the hole, it's short. They'll go to second for one. The relay to first is in time with Jeff Bannister up on that top step immediately to say, hang on a second. We know that Robinson Chirinos doesn't run particularly well. This was a slow roller and slow developing play as you see Steve Bouchelle on the phone. So we'll watch it here. And I think he got in there. Now there has been a little bit of a change in the language. Jeff Bannister still waiting to figure out and use those 30 seconds. There's a clock here now. He's got four, three, two, one. And so now technically we'll see. <laughs> I don't know how definitive that clock is, and I know you guys can't see it, but they now use the in-between innings clock for that 30 seconds. And we know now that Jeff Bannister wants them to take a look at this. I don't think they're going to do it like that. The clock ran out, and then he said it was like oh, a second later. It's kind of arbitrary, a it, little bit. It's a guideline, as we've yeah. mentioned. The other day, the clock ran out, and I think it was uh, Field and Colbreth mm -hmm. turned to the dugout and said, I need an answer. Yeah. All right, so it doesn't, he's not saying your time's up and you can't do it. It's mm -hmm. just, I need an answer. So, so here's the thing. I want to get to this because we got an email about this. And so Major League Baseball, when we first started replay, they were very clear about the fact that they said, on plays like this, when you're looking at them, we're talking about when a ball is considered a catch. It used to be back of the glove. That's what they told us. Not until the ball gets to the back of the glove. Now they are changing that language and they want us to say and for you to realize that now what is considered a catch is when the ball gets into the interior of the glove. So that changes it a little bit. I think he's safe right there anyway. That it looks like the foot is down and the ball is not in the interior of the glove. And we are really, really splitting hairs on interior glove and back of the ball. Back of the glove, excuse me, and they get this one right and Rob Centrinos is safe. Yeah, any contact with the interior of the glove. So if it hits the, I'm gonna tell you something. If it hits the pinky edge of the glove and then rolls into the pocket, all but if it rattles it a little it, bit, that's the problem, matter. right? There's no way if the ball rattles a little bit, you don't have it clean, caught clean. If you bobble it, you're out, right? If it's a real obvious bobble, excuse me, you'll be safe in that situation.